All right, so Sean and Kevin, he's lined up to do a very aggressive little loop. I'm gonna back up and kind of kind of show you. You can see where Dwayne is standing. He's gonna be coming up these big rocks, curving to the left and then the right. So this ought to be pretty entertaining. All right, Sean, it's your show, whatever you like. I'm on a 10 foot boulder here standing up. But this vehicle here is just built so good. And Yeah, take your time, find the line. No, oh, you're gonna get it. There you go. <laughs> Woo! That's impressive. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Maybe just try backing it up a little bit. Wow, look at that. Look at those control arms. Freaking amazing. Looks nice, John. Right here. Yeah, and then and then driver. Wow, nice climb. Woo! <laughs> oh yeah. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Look at that. 
the articulation, the way the back of the tub is cut. <laughs> I'm just sitting here in awe, man. What a, what a show. Absolutely. He probably have no problem with the Fu Manchu and. I mean, this is some aggressive. He just pretty much rolled over anywhere from three and a half, two foot boulders. Beautiful garden that he found, that Dwayne found. So that puts him into what, Tim? That'll put him into Fu Manchu. Fu Manchu. Sean's about to enter Fu Manchu. Wants to get back in soggy bottom. He's. I think it's going to be pretty soggy right now this time of year. It's probably going to be brutal. Yeah, this is this is uh, every wheeler's dream, really. I mean, this thing is just so well built. <laughs> Look at what he's going down. So, so now he's on Fu Manchu. He's going down Fu Manchu. And there we go. Fu Manchu. Sean and his son Kevin are nailing it, man. Look at that. Unbelievable. All right, so he just pretty much went over like a four foot boulder. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, so. So, uh. Not so sure. He can go down as far as he wants. Yeah. This is really good. And where does he loop, where does he loop over? Went back behind us? Hey, Jeremy, nothing crazy. Yeah, so I wanted to keep, they're gonna move uh, our rigs forward a little bit. We're gonna be lined up for soggy bottom. So I just wanted to keep filming Sean. Yeah, so yeah, just find yourself a nice little, however you wanna turn around, then we'll watch you climb up it. Just a remarkably built machine. Uh, quite honestly, I don't even think it was, I don't even think it was challenged. Got there you go, rolled right over the roof. actually just a pleasure to watch. You gotta be real careful because I'm navigating some three and a half, four foot boulders. So he's gonna swing around and now he's gonna climb it. Okay. <laughs> I might do the same! All right, so now Sean just went down Fu Manchu, now he's climbing it. Uh, quite honestly, uh, 
really pretty effortlessly. I mean, this this rig is like built for a, a disaster. It's just so freaking beefy. It's a pleasure to watch. crawling up Fu Manchu. We'll see what the copperhead does for him, but what's harder, Tim? Copperhead or this? Walked it wasn't even a challenge. Kevin, you taking the wheel at some point? Dad let you, huh? Dad let yeah. you drive this thing, huh? Yeah. Have you driven it before? Nope. No? All right, man. You got like two feet and just kind of bounce over it. Go, go driver. So you're just spinning on your rear diff. That's all. You're on your rear diff. Yep, there you go.
There you go. Pick your new line. Front diff. Pass it. Yeah. Yeah, you're trying to get him nice up next to that birch tree, right? Back up, passenger. There you go, line it up. Ooh, almost, almost. Yeah, you'll get it. I think you'll have to, I think you'll have to give it the little bump again. There you go. No, she's going the wrong way. Almost. There it is. There it is. Nice job by Dwayne spotting. And he is putting those big ass tires in some huge holes. Up close to that birch tree, that was the line. Dwayne's repositioning for the next spot. Video's not going to uh, do it justice. It never does. But this is this is like a a red trail all day long, man. And uh, quite honestly, his rig is navigating it with relative ease. I mean, he only really hit the skinny pedal once for one little pop up. Outside of that, he's he's really just been crawling it and finding the lines that he needs. Wow. Phenomenal. Look at that. Let's hope that Dan's doing a better job filming him than he does me. <laughs> uh, nothing. <laughs> There's nothing to see here. <laughs> that was absolutely remarkable to watch. Oh, that trail right there. Down, okay, yeah. Maybe okay. we'll turn around and go out okay. that way. This time, go in. Yeah, there you go. Go driver.
that, Rick? Uh, nothing. I'm videoing you. <laughs> cool. Oh, he, he can what do you think? Okay. We'll go down soggy. Yeah. We'll get through the through yeah. soggy. Let, let him play. Yeah, in and then we'll stop, and then we'll let him play in that gully a little we'll bit. Go up Central Shaft yeah. and take the green loop back. Yeah, and, and go get some food. Right. Yeah, man, I got alcohol. <laughs> oh, I'm on video. Hold on a second. I got to hit stop. This, this guy's a good guy, man. Another firefighter. Uh, yeah. I Another firefighter. To my neighbor for a little, oh, really? Years, this is everybody's yeah. first time meeting him. Yep. Yeah. And he's, so he's new, and brand new. Yeah. And, yeah. And he's and he's well. Well, he said he belonged to it 20 years ago at the early founding when it was just John Fund. Okay. And he named a guy that was president that I never even heard anyone talk about. Never heard his name. Yeah. I just so. Freaking. Yeah, we got to get him to. We got to get him to meet Mike. Great job, man. Great job.